Welcome back everyone. This is my second car from uh, from BCA. Um, you've seen the previous video, that's the first one over there. Uh, the car is still waiting for, well, uh, so far it cost me 520 pounds to get it through the workshop, but they still are not coming from the rear wheel. Um, so hopefully the garage will be free tomorrow and uh, they can book me in. Um, the good news on the Mini is that it doesn't need anything beside a service which is good it's a winner i was expecting because like you guys said you can't really trust bca and their reports um but this one was not from we buy any car i think it was part exchanged to a dealer or something um so yeah the body it looks all right i'm not happy with this strip and this is vinyl i'm not sure how i'm going to fix that uh, or i'll probably just leave it as it is um by the way wait till the end of the video because i've got a important announcement to make um the headlights need restoration get that done we'll try using a heat gun to restore the plastics all around the car you see it's got this plastic bumper going around by the way this is my first mini ever never had one before um here it's a bit dirty um i think it was when uh, it was on the transporter or something um i might have to replace the windshield not too sure let's see i think i think it needs a new one well, the good thing is you don't have to spend much money on the car anyway. Um, yeah, it looks pretty bad from this angle. But to be fair, the bodywork is pretty good. For a 2008 car, it looks, it looks very good. Now, on the inside... Pretty clean give the, the seats clean but it looks better in real life for some reason on the video it looks more um, like gray color but they're actually black so I don't know why my phone does that that's the back seat I think the person who had this car was smoking because I can see her she's around here so yeah the car has two keys which is good uh, the service history is not the best. Um, it's got locking wheel nut, which is good. Otherwise, it would have cost me sixty pounds to, to take the wheels off. Um, and yeah, it's not bad. Honestly, I'm impressed with the quality on this mini. I like the materials, and it it's just it doesn't feel like a cheap car. Like I said in my previous reel, um, it feels a lot better than a Corsa or a Fiesta or anything similar uh, that's a bit dirty but I'm sure I can get that sorted so my plan for now is for today because the weather was rubbish lately um, my plan is to get the interior done today I've got some floor mats coming um, so I'll just go around with some multi-purpose cleaner and uh, I'll apply some dressing so I'll get that out the way uh, the engine bay, bay is not the cleanest, so I'll get that sorted as well. And tomorrow, I'm going to machine polish the, um, the exterior and um, I'll try to restore this plastic trim. Alloys, not the best. Some corrosion there. Uh, don't think I'm going to repaint them because it's a cheap car. But we're going to go through the numbers in a second. Uh, and yeah, I'm really happy with the car. It drives nice, clutch feels nice, because I've heard they are very expensive um, to get it done because you have to take all the front end out. And I've, I've watched a video on YouTube and it looks like a big job. It's probably like seven, 800 pounds to, to get that sorted. Um, and yeah, I think it's gonna be a good seller. I like the color, it's nice dark blue. Well, it's dirty now, but after I do my magic, the car is going to look a lot, a lot better. Now, let's go through the figures quickly. This is going to be a short video, guys, by the way. Um, 
just wanted to show you the second car and what I think about BCA so far. So let me get the list. Oh, it was so much easier when I was using my my GoPro and I could just check on my phone everything. Right. So look at this. There's a helicopter going around, probably looking for someone. Um, right. For the car, I paid nine hundred and fifty pounds. Uh, the fees were two hundred and thirty-seven. Uh, the check it was eleven pounds forty, uh, and the delivery was one hundred pounds and fifty-four p. So altogether is one thousand two hundred and ninety-eight pounds and ninety-four p, which I think is good. Um, I'm really happy with uh, with how much I paid for the car and the fact that it only needs a service. It's really good. That's like a hundred pounds. Uh, the tires are good. Um, and yeah, no problems. When I first started the car, I thought it was a bit a bit loud, the engine, because I've heard they got problems with the timing chain. But I went to the garage, they said it's it's fine. Like I said, I never had this engine before, so I don't know what, what it sounds like. And if I hear any noise, I panic. That That's just me. Um, and yeah, and the announcement is I was getting loads and loads of messages about uh, the insurance I've got and which company I'm using. So I've been using the same company for, this is my third year, third time buying a, a trader insurance. Uh, it's just been renewed a couple of months ago. Uh, but the good news is uh, they are willing to offer a discount to my subscribers. Uh, so stay tuned because I'm gonna make a video about it in the cu next couple of days. Um, as soon as we um, we set everything up, how it's going to work. Are they going to give me a discount code or is it like affiliate link or something like that? Um, and yeah. And by the way, guys, if you want to support the channel, um, all the products I've listed below, the products that I'm using, that's an affiliate link. So basically, I get a commission if you click on that link and buy the product from Amazon through, through that link. You'll be paying exactly the same price. I'll just get like 2 or 3% of the product value something like that and that would really help the channel um and yeah um I, I might do a video on this car how to uh how to machine polish the car uh i won't be able to do a video on the interior today because i'm trying to get it out of the way um as quick as possible um and yeah i think this is going to turn up in a really nice car to be fair um i bought a third car which is a citroen c1 is red not a big fan of red cars but it looks in good shape uh, it had a green report um, and i might get that delivered tomorrow so i'll make a video about that one as well uh, fingers crossed it's going to be a nice one and i won't have to spend too much money on it and um, yeah like i said in the previous video i was thinking to buy a car for myself but now i'm off uni for two weeks so there's no point buying a car for myself just now so what I'll do is, I'll buy another two or three cars from uh, from BCA and I'll try to flip them before I st start the uni and buy something for myself, maybe a nice convertible or something. But I, I feel like I need, I need a nice car. Thank you so much for watching the video, guys. Um, like I said, there will be a lot more content coming. Uh, it's just a bit difficult to plan uh, my preparation and all that because the weather has been shit lately. Um, was raining all day then 10 minutes sunny then again a few hours of rain and so on. I just couldn't I couldn't do any work I was planning to do the video on this car a few days ago but again I couldn't do it because because of the weather I had the car delivered on on Friday no on Thursday which was pretty quick because um, the estimated was to be delivered on the 5th of April or something like that um, so they delivered it oh and another thing uh, when I looked at the delivery fees on BCA I thought they would deliver the car by road but actually came on a transporter so they're using those big trucks with I don't know five ten cars on uh, so they just stopped on the main road got the car down for me and uh, that's it so thank you so much for watching guys um i'm also have a tiktok account uh which apparently i get a lot more views 
then on YouTube, which is good. Uh, so yeah, follow me on TikTok as well. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. Bye.